Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Super Robot Wars Original Generations. Now before we actually go to the next stage, I need to point out something I forgot to mention in the last video. And that would be, uh, if I can go to the right area, Gilliam's skills and Radas. Well, as you can see, Gilliam has Prophecy, and it's evade at, uh, up at 130 plus will, counter only. He's got Attacker, Hitting Away, and SP regain, Regenerate, and Counter 2. Woo. I mean, I, you do need counter uh, to, at least, to use Prophecy so it can activate. But, yeah, whatever. The, the greatest thing here is hitting away, attacker, and SP gener regenerate. Makes him pretty godly. Rada also has uh, Prophecy, SP regenerate, and support level 1. I have no idea why she doesn't have counter. I'm happy she doesn't have counter. Makes her kind of useless. But before I do anything, I'm actually going to change Russell to a different, well, yeah, to a different mech, to actually, actually, ugh, to an actual mech, the Gaspins, Mach 2, medium, we're obviously going to have to assign him some weapons now, he's still going to be my healer, so, oops, wrong one, oops, wrong one, let's just go to equip, not customize, uh, Russell, Go ahead and give you a supply module. And uh, do I want to give you anything else? Uh, maybe a knife. Maybe, maybe. Okay, no one has a hyper beam rifle. Okay, I might give that to somebody. Good. Good, good. Ooh, another slash ripper, too. Uh, I'm not really sure who I want to give this to. One thing I do want to give is, oh, Ison, you do not have a perfectly long-range attack move, so Hyper Beam Rifle, say hello. Uh, then we're going to give you some other weapons. Give you a, mm, no, I don't want to give you that. Give you a Mega Beam Rifle, never bad there. Uh, Russell, give you. you a sword. Yeah, beam sword. Don't want to give anybody anything, anything else. Bullets. You do have a steel knife. No, I think that'll be all for right now. I think we'll be okay. I don't, I don't see any problems. Actually, let me see part-wise. I need to... You don't need a water jet. Let's go ahead and give you a poggy motor. No. Geez, so unprofessional. I don't even know what I want to give you. I'll give you that. Give you that. Let me see. Who has the worst? You have an A. A, A, S, S, A. Okay, yeah, we'll be fine now. We're going to space? I just finished a land max. Tell me about it. I wish they respect us for once. At least we got the cutie from Mal Industries to look at. <sighs> what the? No, Lieutenant Excellent, move like this. Wait, wait. What are you doing? Oh, Tasaku, or Tasuku. Did you hear me groaning? Yeah, you sound like a frog being squashed. I was learning a yoga beauty pose, Ziz. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Miss Rada's a yoga master. Well, I wouldn't call myself a master, but... The results of my teachings speak for themselves. I'll try again later when I'm more flexible. I think I'm going to be more be sore tomorrow. What kind of poses causes that? Sorry to stop, Miss Rada. I gotta get back to work. I understand. Mr. Tasuku, where is the gig in Scudo? What? We're going to use that thing? Dr. Karzahara asked me to convert the cockpit section. We don't have much choice since our boss joined the DC. I'll help you. That thing is big and hard to maintain. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hey, Tasuku, you're acting like a fool in love. If he starts acting weird, just put him in one of those back-breaking yoga po positions, Miss Rada. Uh, for real? Oh, well, yoga isn't meant for... Yeah, it's not meant for that. You want to talk to me, Kiyosuke? 
Yes, sir. About Songer, the former ATX leader. Yes, I know. I don't think he's defected just because we're facing difficult times. Then again, I don't really know him, but you do. What do you make of his actions? Songer is a man of conviction. He will fight for what he believes in. If that's what he intends to do, we must meet him head on. Yeah, that's what I thought. He additionally left the cargo unharmed. Then he'll show up again once we're in space. Captain, we're out of the atmosphere. Any sign of pursuers or interceptors? No. Well, let's run the search again, just to be sure. Affirmative. Exo, is the Gigan Scudo operational? We could deploy it, but... But? But Gigan Scudo is more like a super robot than a PT. And it has endosyncrasies in its uh, control system. We can't apply our PT know-how to do it. Know-how to do? Uh, I still know how to it. Uh, I don't know why I said to do, but whatever. Miss Rada is currently converting the cockpit into a standard PT system. You can keep the po cockpit as it is. I'll pilot Gigan. I can't allow Hellcat to pilot that son of a gun. Hellcat? I'm serious here. I prefer not using Gigan Scudo as much as possible. Why not? The UCC has been dropping onto the Earth since they secured Columna, the Columna, which means we're being overlooked. Or they're setting a trap. Hmm, maybe. In any case, I'm tired of sitting around like this. Come or don't come, who cares? Just make up your mind. Watch out, when she gets all riled up like this, that means there's going to be an earthquake. I'm not a starfish. I knew it. Enemy attack. I told you. Never mind that. Let's go. Exo. What is it, Captain? I thought it was catfish that could predict quakes. Yes, well, let's just focus on the battle, shall we? It's really weird for Lufina to act like that. Episode 10. Confrontation. ID confirmed. UCC Space Fighters. Strange, their setup is slow. Yeah, most of our mechs are Gespies, but this atmosphere better suits their AMs. No time to mess around, we gotta get going. Uh, I guess we do. So, I have no particular pattern or, or of where I want them to position, but... So that'll work. As expected, they're not going to let us reach the moon without a fight. This is their backyard, so beware of guard dogs. Yes, but I don't see the owner around. We'll meet him soon enough. Let's get going. Watch your backs. We may get pursuers from Earth. So we don't get sandwiched. Got it. Indeed. So we don't get sandwiched. Hey, guys. There's no battle mastery. Yet. Anyways. Uh, type R. Move you on over here. You can pretty much deal with all these guys yourself. Uh, these are the, uh, the Ragzins, the one unit we just got, the green, uh, fighter unit we just got. Again, they're not that great, but they have a S in space, unlike the, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, the F-28 Messer. So, they are good, but again, they're not that agile, so, watch yourself before you wreck yourself. Well, Russell, I'm happy to see you, uh, in a Gespi. Looks nice on ya. Can I want to drive these enemies towards me more than anything else? Because they can hit pretty hard. They have two attacks. Uh, I think one's auto cannon and the other's beam cannon. So play it safe, guys. Yeah, excellent. You can support for me, please. Thank you. That beam shield comes in handy. Russell, you motherfucking beast, you can support and you'll take a hit like a boss. Haha, <laughs> nice. I missed my F-28 Messer already. Learned new skill or spirit, SL. And you're level 10, so yay! You know what? Uh, yeah, uh, uh, 
uh, sure, why not? Originally, I didn't want to use it because I used up energy, but I'm like, ah, he has no other moves besides that that use up energy. So, what can it hurt? Take this! The Beam Saber matches my call of the guest beam. Hey, hey, hey. Love having three people that can support me. Kaina needs that. She can't really handle herself without that right now. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? If this hits, this will definitely kill uh, the enemy. Kaboom! And come to your death, buddy. No need to show that. Counter, dead. Let's trigger it. It's the Hyrule Custom, just as we expected. What's the status of the shuttle? It's on the way to Sector L4, ma'am. Good, we'll bite some time until it reaches there. Roger that. Those are the UCC AMs from that day Langley base fell. Judging by the markings on their mechs, that's a Troy unit. Troy unit? UCC Royal Guards, all and an all female pilot unit. Wow, Tasuku would, would definitely want to join them. I'm surprised you made it through the DC Brigade. But your luck will run out soon run out. <laughs> Whatever, Troy Unit. I'll get you all for Langley. I don't see you, Sanger. Where are you? So here comes our battle mastery. Julia or Leona shot down within four four turns. We're on our second turn, and it'd be kind of stupid to go ahead and finish this up by killing one of them. So let's take out all these guys. We need as much experience anyways. Hi, how are you? Time to die. Or maybe not yet. Ouch. You got very lucky with that. Level 11... And, uh, let's go ahead and... Can't do it just yet, so... Focus! It's time to murder people. It looks so awkward with that machine gun. You're dead. <laughs> Should almost be good. Let's twin beam it. Nice close up, though. That's really awesome looking. This is nothing. Oh, I'm unable to counterattack. Yeah, unbeknownst to you, they have very, really feminine voices. I know, isn't that creepy? Let's go ahead and use alert. Nice. Now I'm not sure of the percentage of uh, the high read custom. I should have checked it out, but if it hit, it doesn't hit. That's okay. No biggie. Oh wow, it actually hit. This should kill. <laughs> right on. Nice. 
Now, Russell, will you be able to take a hit? Oh, it's auto cannon. <laughs> Pitiful. Let's revolver stake some. Hey, might as well attack, too. Uh, let's see, a homing missile. Yeah, long range missile will do good. See if I can weaken one. I don't really want to technically get hit right now, but. Can't do anything about it. I guess you can't do anything about it. I didn't expect to see you guys here. Likewise, I didn't expect to have a chance at revenge. We're at war. Soldiers shouldn't have emotions. No matter, this will be your last fight. Or, I kind of like that better. This, this fight will be your last. No, this will be your last fight. You just say it up to him. This is our domain. Do you think you're up for it? Home field advantage won't decide the winner. Don't underestimate your enemy. Thanks for the lecture. Yeah, and that shows you that you're weak. <laughs> Getting really unlucky with those uh, freaking evade percentages. 29, that's it's almost a guaranteed miss. But I guess the RNG goddess is not with me today. Come on, people, stop attacking him. Try to, yeah, or at least you dodge that one. Nice. Eh, yeah, that should be all. Well, they want to go after Russell. They're just going to, you know, freaking sign their death. Uh, death, uh, da, 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 what's the word for it? Uh, they're going to sign their de own death note. Oh, yeah, dog. I went there. <laughs> that was so corny. Russell, level 10. Hey, now. Dead now. Oh, Russell, you are a badass. Let's heal your ass. Well, I should have healed Erm, or er, uh, Gilliam, but mm, whatever. Should be a kill. Okay, let's move you uh, right here. That'd be good. And I'll put you right here, so we have two supports. That's always good to have. Use another alert just for the sake of using it. Team Leak Ripper. Support me, please. Boom. Shaka Laka. Kill another. Uh. Yeah. Go ahead and kill. I didn't want to kill one that was half dead already. That'd be a waste of a bullet. Or a bullet, since. They don't just shoot one bullet. Ooh, nice. Uh, set you up in position. Uh, no, we'll stay back here. <laughs> I don't want to get too far ahead of myself right now. Uh, yeah. Uh, go ahead and do it, Russell. You will be my support unit, so the higher, the quicker I get you leveled up, uh, the better, because we need your support SP, or spirit points. Be on over here, Jet Magnum. Yeah, we'll play it safe and use the Jet Magnum. Because I'm not sure if you'll be able to kill him with a machine gun. Plus, I, you know, I'm a sucker for, I guess, be using Jet Magnum. Can't help it. Looks like this will be your final dance, Line F. Only two left, and we can only take down one. Farewell, buddy. Okay, let's wait. I figured they weren't going to move, so... 
We'll let him just go ahead and take the hit. Not like it's going to hurt me a lot. Uh, try evading. Well, Gilliam, let's repair you right now. Now, who do I want to take down? This is the fourth turn, so it's time to sink or swim. Let's use a focus. I really don't care for their item, so... So, she's good. She beat me on my home field, so I'm gonna win this away. Game. Ha, <laughs> you're not going to defeat me on my home field. This should be a kill. I'll be utterly surprised if not. Yeah, it's a kill. <laughs> yeah, I really don't care about, you know, the items they have, so... Let's just get the damn uh, freaking skill point. We had the advantage in outer space. Yeah, you did. We stalled them long enough. Troy unit, retreat. There's nothing left. <laughs> we got a cartridge. Useless. Battle mastery earned, though. Incoming contact from Earth. A shuttle? No, it's... Shit! <laughs> da, 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 da. That's... No doubt about it. Boss! That's typo is amazing. It made it out to outer space alone. Tell me why, Songer. We're destined to fight Gilliam, that's all. Huh, <laughs> you never change. Is this for real? I have to fight my old boss? Major, please tell us why. You don't need to. Captain, wake up. Huh? Sorry, but we're in the middle of a fight, and that man is merely an enemy backup. Yes, yes, I'm a traitor. I'm your enemy. If this battle means something, I'll fight you, Sanger Zumvolt. Yes, you are a soldier. When you are on the battlefield, focus your energy on defeating your enemy. Then you will find the answer the aggressors were once seeking. The answers the aggressors were once seeking? Yep, so we have to fight our uh, old boss now. Woo. Yeah, he's tough. It's a typo. It's a typo, so, you know, it's, it's not going to be easy. Let's go ahead and start using spirits. <laughs> What's your chances of hitting anyways? Uh, I should check before I actually... Uh, 82. That's not bad, actually. Let's do it. Something the aggressors were seeking? Yes, the goal we ultimately failed to achieve. We must complete our mission quickly for the sake of mankind. Is that why you betrayed the EFA? Yeah, and guys, you use your uh, your evade abilities, your guard abilities, everything, because his punches hurt. Nice, a hit. Damage is damage, so I can't really complain about that. We'll go ahead and... Dealing Gripper. Boss, I don't want to fight you. If you lose your will to fight on this battlefield, you'll die. If you want, don't want to send. Uh, if you don't want to fight, then I'll send you to hell. Don't you get it? I'm not your boss. I'm your enemy. That was awesome. You need more than luck to beat him. Guy ain't playing around. Yeah, like this will do anything. But again, like I said, damage is damage. 84, right on. You're gonna get killed if I put you right there. I don't know who I wanna. Yay, I just did it because I want experience. It does lower your will by 10 if you do that, so... Yeah, if you don't want that happening, don't do it. 
Uh, you're going to need to heal a little bit. Heal escape before I do anything with you, so we'll wait. Yeah, that'll work. The more you fight the UCC, the more ground you lose. We'll never stop fighting. Either way, we don't have a choice. You may be the only one who knows what this war is leading to. I don't know, and I don't care. Yay, E-Field! Mmm, a hit! I didn't think that 61 was gonna hit. Hell yeah. Right on. Hey, we learned sense! Awesome! That's great! That is... Oh, you don't know how awesome that is. Anyways, uh, let's continue doing this shit then, shall we? Let's go ahead and use a strike. Before I do that, I kind of want Exxon to attack. Can he hit from all the way over here? He cannot. Or, well, he can, but he's not going to have a chance. This is the first time I've seen you in space, boss. I'm glad you made it this far. I knew you could do it. Why won't you tell us what's going on? It's meaningless if you don't figure it out yourself. Oh, come on. Even quiz shows give you some kind of hint. Enough. Here I come. I want to try to get everybody's reaction to him leaving right now. It's like I'm gonna fake you out. You think I'm gonna use my, uh, you know, little cannons on my hand, but no, I'm not. Tubular. You approved, but you're not, still not good enough. What? Damn. He's aiming at the higher you custom. Evasion action. We're not gonna make it. This isn't good. If we are hit. By that colossal blade, we'll be done for. Turn the ship to reduce the damage. Captain, the bottom hatch is opening. What? You don't mean... g, -g, -g and Scudo is being prepped for deployment. No, who's in it? Good. Releasing lock bolts. Tasuku? Electrod set. Charging the Tesla drive. Boost on, okay? Time to test my luck. Giga Scundo. Who's in it? Tasaku, stop. Gigan isn't ready. Hmm. <laughs> They're playing their trump card? But if you stand in my way, I'll slash you in half. No, you won't. Time to test my luck. Oh, I love this part. Yeah, in your face, Sanga. Uh, uh, Tasaku, my ribs. Tasaku, are you okay? Hang in there. I was right. If I focus on defense, I can do this. The higher you is safe, but Tasuku's in trouble. What's Gigan's status? Its primary armor and drive systems are down. It can't move. No. All units protect the Gigan Scudo. You are brave, but... <laughs> Do you realize the paradox here, Major? What? When the strongest sword and the toughest shield in the world collide. Well, as you can see, the Colossal Blade is broken. <laughs> yes, I can see it now. He's not going to finish off Gigan Scudo? Very well. This will ser serve as my souvenir. What? Yes, a tough but cursed shield. To wipe the slate clean. You must continue to win. Remember that, Tasuku. Wipe the slate clean? We will cross swords again. I'll let you live until then. Farewell! He didn't kill me. Bastard, I won't let you get away. Wait, we must help Tasuku first. 
We have to retrieve Gigan and leave this area. That's right. So, he's really... What is he trying to accomplish? Our fight has meaning, doesn't it, Kiyosuke? I don't know. Only we can decide whether or not it has meaning. Ow! Ow! Can't you hold still? No, my ribs are broken! They're just bruised, thanks to the airbags. Whatever, just be gentle. Don't be such a baby. It's not like I'm punching you. That's true. Ow! Un, what do you have against men? Were you dumped? Why would you ask that? Hit a nerve, did I? How's Taisoku? Oh, he's fine. Just a bruise. Nothing to worry about. That's good. I wish Miss Rada was treating me. She's gentle. Would you like to try some therapeutic yoga? <laughs> no, thanks. Hey, have you finished converting Gigan's cockpit? Not yet. It's going to take a little longer to finish. Then I'll be the aero pilot, right? Yes, but y you can't because. Uh, blah. But you can't be afraid to use it against the UCC. I know the story behind it, but we have no choice. We must use whatever it takes to survive. What's the story behind it? You never heard of the Hope Incident? N no. Ask Excellent about it then. Is that what Sanger meant by wipe the slate clean? You seem depressed. Want me to cheer you up, Bullet? Lieutenant, please stop. Wow, going through a moody period, are we? Major Sunger has betrayed us all! He's not with us anymore. Aren't you upset? That's just reality. What do you want me to do? Well... She's right, Bullet. Sunger's our enemy now. I just can't believe it. But I don't think he betrayed us. Huh? Why's that? Perhaps the boss turned on us for a reason. Like what? That we didn't know. That we don't know. But he didn't finish off Gigan Scudo. True. I want to believe in him too. I worked with him a lot longer than you guys did. We don't know his true intent. But I'm sure he doesn't want us to stop fighting because of our feelings. Yeah. I just don't understand how the DC can trust him. Elzum's mentioned mentioned the tribulations. Is the war of the DC setting the stage for something bigger? You must be Sunger Zumvolt. I heard a lot about you. Yes, sir. What's wrong? First time at Ellipse? El uh, Ellipse? Or Ellipse? I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. No, sir. I was once enemy of the DC and the UCC. It's not very safe for you to be near a man like me. What are you trying to say, Major? This would be a good chance for me to assassinate him. Huh? Then why don't you kill me? Because I know you're testing me. And I don't kill those who are looking to die. <laughs> you're an interesting man. Sanger Ellipsis was the first space colony he'd ever built. Even with the failure of the space adaption operation, oppression by the Earth Federation and terrorism, the colonists still built ten colonies for our motherland. And do you know why? To explore the uncharted worlds of our space. Yes, we live in an enclosed space surrounded by a vacuum. But the irrigators threaten our path to glory. Once again, mankind must overcome this tribulation. I understand that you and Commander Bien started this war to let the world know the truth. That's true, and we still need you to be our sword and fight for the cause. Yes, sir. I'm willing to tarnish my name for the cause. Hell, man, that was some pretty serious stuff there, if I do say so myself. Um, anyway, guys, that's gonna be all for this video, so I'd like to thank you for watching, and see you next time.